it's Breezy Summer Reads time. These are 16 of our favorite books for kindergarten through second graders. Some to enjoy on your own. Some to enjoy with a grown-up or your whole family. All chosen by us to be joyful, thought-provoking, unique, and fun. Let's get breezy! Now this is how to read a book. Look at all the colors and patterns and cutouts. I just want to touch those pages and read the book over and over again. I love how this book feels. We are all connected. What would our world look like without tigers? I'll take good care of you. Caves are super interesting and maybe a bit creepy. And that's why we like to read this book together. Oh, Shelly, I'm so glad we're reading this together. Me too. Gravity got his name for a reason. He really is the Eagles' greatest player. But can he take his team to victory all alone? Sometimes even grown-ups need to relax and take some time out to think about who they really are. In True You, we meet kids who express themselves in all sorts of different ways. In Am I Even a Bee, the main character doesn't look like many bees she knows, but she's still a bee. I love the stunning book that looks old-fashioned and you can play I Spy with it. Bet you can't find her. There she is. In this fun story based on the author's life, eight-year-old JD proves that kids can be just as talented and successful as grown-ups, or maybe even more so. Two great books about food. Can Frank and Bean win the food truck competition with donuts and oatmeal? Harlem Grown tells the amazing true story of how a community transformed a vacant lot into a thriving urban farm. Esme's grandparents gave Esme a guitar for her birthday, but they don't know anything about planning a fun birthday party, so problem-solving Esme figures it out. Noemi and her mama join other refugees at the U.S.-Mexican border, where they look for the important person who keeps count and records whose turn it is to cross the border, the notebook keeper. It's fun to write letters and put them in a mailbox, but when the mailbox is in the middle of a quiet forest, who is writing back to Mayu? In this beautiful graphic novel, a girl's vacation takes a fantastical turn when she finds a bright pink feather in her grandmother's house. Can brave knight Sir Ladybug and his pals save their friend from an evil monster with the magical power of cake? Reina has the best ideas on how she'll be Frida Kahlo for her class project. But her friend Nora wants to be Frida Kahlo. Can Reina find someone else to be? These are the wonderful books we wanted to share with you. They're easy to find right next to the kids' desk. Happy reading! Happy reading!